guys know, I was definitely coming back with some scenarios for you guys to get some hot items. Super cheap this week since Walgreens didn't want to give it to us themselves. Hey guys, this is Jay, Coupon and Craze. I'm about to show you guys how to do a scenario with the spend 20, get 5,000 points back. These look exactly like this puppy here. So as you guys can see, it says spend 20, get five, spend 20 or more, get $5 back in points. So equivalent to 5,000 points. I have always let you guys know that my favorite thing to do is to use points on a spend deal. Okay, pause. This here, this guy, is the only one you cannot use points on. No matter what, it, like no, don't try to do any calculations around it. If you use points on this puppy here, it's gonna automatically not give you the points back. The old ones that had a different barcode would let you, but these new ones, nope. Walgreens got strict on us. So, if you guys have this guy, do not use points ever. It doesn't matter, just don't. But I have a nice scenario for you guys that looks just as stated there above. I let you guys know that my favorite thing really to buy is gonna be like oral products because you guys will always need those. We do not want bad breath. <laughs> so I am using this coupon, or I'm sorry, not a coupon, a Catalina printout that you will randomly get from other transactions and you should only use one at a time because like I said, it's spent 20 or more. So using two is kind of pointless. And we use these and create scenarios to get the best out of things. So I'm super excited because these mouthwash that I am talking about right here, we're getting three of them. And if you don't know, MW will always stand for mouthwash. It's these big puppies. These guys. Yes, this big one. Um, it is the 33.8 fluid ounces. So you are getting the big guys. It's not the small one. You will be picking up three of them. So each one of those guys is $4.79. But they are buy two, get the third one free. So our total for those three is going to be $9.58. Next... We have our little deal on the Venus. This is, I touched base on the Gillette in my video on Sunday, but I did mess up. It's not a register reward. It is points you are getting back. And this one is tagged at $9.99. So it is the two cartridges. I actually really like this one. So you just wanna get this guy and it's gonna be $9.99. And then the last item that you wanna pick up is my favorite frosted flakes so we are getting this one that's 13.5 ounces they are on sale this week at a dollar and 99 cents so that is added to our shopping cart so when we do the math we are getting all those products there it is going to be 21 dollars and 56 cents so if we take this into play $20, our threshold is met, but of course, we never want to pay this much money. What we will be using is a $7 digital that looks just like that, and that is a 7 off of 3. Yes, so we are buying 3 mouthwash, and we have that coupon. Typically, in the store, you wouldn't want to use a coupon on the free product, but this is a digital, so it is automatically attaching to just buying three, even though you're only paying for two. So we're gonna subtract $7 there. The Venus, we also do have a digital coupon, which is $4 off of one. So we'll jot that down over here. And so minus four. And then lastly, there is a digital coupon, which is 50 cents off of one minus 50. And our total comes down to $10 and six cents. So I want to show you guys that I did already do this transaction. Here is my receipt. So you have the scope at the top. You buy to get the third one free the Frosted Flakes, the Venus, and then we have our coupon. So this first one right up here, this point coupon 20, that's that guy right up there. 
And then we have the $4 off for the Venus, 50 cents for the cereal, and $7 for the Crest, bringing our total down to 10.06. That looks familiar. So 1006 is what we are paying out of pocket. Of course, we do pay um, plus tax. And then the cool part about this is that it doesn't stop there. So you paid 1006. We are getting 5,000 points. Oops, that just made it worse. Let's not deal with that. So 5,000 points from this. Plus, when you buy one of these Venus razors, you are getting 3,000 points back, so 3K. And then you are also getting 50 cents, actually this is 40, excuse me, 45 cents from Ibotta on the cereal. So, you take 1006 minus five minus a three, and I'll show you that that is what I got in points you can see from the same transaction and i'll flip it right over so here is everything the same transaction i got the eight thousand points five from the spend 20 get five thousand points back and then three from the venus so when you do the calculations i had done my calculations on 50 cents because now i can't remember if it's 50 cents or 45 on the kellogg's it does depend what cereal cereal you get so basically if it's 50 cents back on a bottom from that cereal you paid a whopping one dollar and 56 cents for all of these products so you just got three huge sized of the mouthwash a very very good razor and the best cereal ever for a dollar and fifty six cents and that's why I love these so definitely if you get one of these these are not garbage do not throw them away because I will always show you guys deals on how to make it work with items you actually need for your household so you don't get them for so expensive especially like if it's on a week where for example, the mouthwash, it's not a great deal by itself, but when you incorporate it into something like this, it comes out to be an awesome deal. So that is it. I hope the whiteboard is a little bit more easy to understand. And definitely let me know if you guys have any questions. I did make a post asking you guys what type of items you guys needed. And this is kind of an idea of what people needed. So I am going to try to base off my scenarios on what you guys need to try to help you guys out as much as possible. So always feel free to like comment on any videos and say like, hey, is there any way that you could try to figure out how to incorporate this item into one of your scenarios. And I can definitely do that, but guys. So thanks for watching. I do have another scenario coming up tomorrow. I have been getting lucky this week. And as you guys can see, I have this other one. So I'll be showing you guys how to use another one of these. Also, these, you can't, there's like no way to try to get them. So like, if you don't have one and you want one, we just have to, it's the luck. <laughs> I have noticed that if you use accounts that you don't sh typically shop with, these will print out. So like an account that I don't typically use my coupons on, I just randomly used it for whatever reason on that account, it did print one of these. So just to keep that in mind, thanks for watching guys. Let me know if you guys have any questions and I will touch base later.